Good afternoon. This week we're going to take a look at a selection of items that do more or less the same thing, but can vary quite a lot in their effectiveness. Today we'll be looking at more or less everything from Terraria that can be put in a bottle which makes you jump higher. There are five items in Terraria that can be classified as so-called jump bottles. Substances contained within bottles that can make a person jump higher. These are the sandstorm, cloud, blizzard and tsunami in a bottle. The final item is slightly different in that it's actually a fart in a jar rather than a bottle. Crude I know but it functions now and identically to the others. The general use of these items, which can be known collectively as jump bottles, is to allow the user to conduct a double or otherwise enhanced second jump after their first. The lesser jump bottles are often the first items an individual can obtain that enhance their abilities somehow, and are considered by many to be precursors of the wings. However, many continue to use them for extended periods in order to augment their other abilities. Although the five different items appear on the face of it to be vastly different, they all behave more or less the same as each other, but can vary considerably in their effectiveness. The cloud in a bottle, the weakest of the jump bottles, allows for a user to perform a double jump that can increase their jump height by 10 feet. Both the tsunami and blizzard in a bottle also allow for a double jump, but are both more powerful, allowing for an additional 14 and 16 feet of jump height respectively. However, the blizzard in a bottle doesn't just allow for a second jump, but actively propels its user upwards. The fart in a jar is unique in that it's the only item on the list to be in a jar rather than a bottle, and it's actually crafted when the cloud in a bottle is combined with a whoopee cushion. Functionally, it is not dissimilar to the other jump bottles and behaves almost like a combination of the cloud and blizzard in a bottle, allowing for a second jump to be performed before the user is propelled upwards, extending their jump height up to 21 feet. The final item is a sandstorm in the bottle, which allows for the user to perform a double jump and be launched upwards at an accelerated rate, similarly to the blizzard in a bottle, although spinning as they go, and they can be propelled up to an additional 30 feet. All of these items are capable of being combined with the effects of the shiny red balloon, which increases the user's initial jump height to create, for instance, a cloud and a balloon rather than a bottle. Furthermore, if a cloud, a blizzard and a sandstorm in a bottle are converted into their balloon variants, these resultant products can then be combined to create the bundle of balloons, an item that can combine the effects of all four of its major constituent effects, allowing for an extended quadruple jump. This jump can then be augmented further by stacking it with other bottles or balloons to allow for a jump that can rival the height attained by wings. The only downside is that fall damage is a constant risk unless a lucky horseshoe has been equipped. While the combination of all these items may sound impressive, the fact that an adventurer's inventory can be quickly filled up with these stacked items makes obtaining a pair of wings the preferable avenue. However, if crafting a pair is not currently an option, then this may be a suitable stopgap. Despite their differing strengths, the general usefulness and rarity of all five of the jump bottles means that they are much more similar than they initially appear. As such, the jump bottles have been collectively given the artifact rating of noteworthy. So, in a similar vein to our lecture on the wings of Terraria, this is merely an overview, and it's possible to do a deep dive into each of these items individually, giving them their own sub-ratings, although that may have to be something we look at way down the road, as we've got a lot of material to be working through in the meantime. Make sure to subscribe for more course content, and as always, it would help if you would drop a dollar into our Patreon, so that we can keep the lights on around here. Have a great week, and I will see you all next time.